have to make do with less money next year. The city's proposed budget for 2015 is more than $56 million less than this year's. May seem like a drastic change, but the deputy mayor says there is a reason for it. WSBT's James Fillmore is at the live desk tonight. And James, even with less money, the city has identified some priorities here. Well, the majority of the money will be going to utilities, public safety, and economic development, Jennifer. But the city says property tax caps are hitting local governments like South Bend hard. More than $311 million is the city of South Bend's proposed budget for 2015. That's down from $367 million this year. In 2015, the largest chunk of money would go to utilities. Wastewater, trash pickup. Uh, leaf uh, pickup in the uh, in the fall. All those constitute our, our utilities budget. A $56 million difference may seem like a lot, but Mark Neal says part of it is because of money the city has borrowed in the past. This year, they had to pay more of it back, so they budgeted for it. But in 2015, there won't be as much money to pay back, so they don't need to leave room for as much money. One thing the city is not willing to sacrifice is public safety, which is slated to get the second largest amount next year. Do not expect to see an increase in the number of uh, either sworn uh, police officers or firefighters, but we certainly do expect that we will be making other investments in our, our public safety. Aaron Goldstein is the owner of Michiana Brewers Supply. He recently opened up shop in downtown South Bend on Michigan Street. He was happy to hear that another one of South Bend's priorities for the budget is economic development. Ultimately, that grows more jobs. Um, if you can get more businesses down here, um, it's just better for everybody. Neil says investing in economic development will help create jobs and attract new companies to the city. The budget also includes projects that the city thinks people living in South Bend will appreciate. Our Smart Streets Initiative related to our Western and, and Lincoln Way corridors, looking at our Parks Five Year Master Plan, also just looking at how we're taking neighborhoods and providing additional lighting, looking at curb and sidewalk work to be done in the future. Mark Neal says the South Bend Common Council needs to approve a budget for 2015 by November 1st. They can approve the proposed budget or reduce the amount, but they cannot add to it. At the Live Desk, James Fillmore, WSBT Channel 22 News.